I don't know how this is gonna turn out. This is a recipe of YouTube and legitimately just using what's already here. Some pack of oatmeal. I have salt that I brought with me and I brought some cinnamon with me as well. Got my timer going. And I just have to have two bananas that are getting really ripe. I've had a shower and it's totally flooded in here. Oh, this bathroom is the worst. Hi travelers, I'm Anne's daughter Laliko. So welcome to the plus, the second plus seven of my isolation. I have already done my 14 days in Shanghai, seven days in the hotel here. Now I'm on to my second set of 12 hours. My <laughs> It's so confusing. I'm so confused. I don't know why they just don't say, look, you've got six weeks and you have to move like three or four times. It's been a lot because I have got more space to kick around in. That's a positive. Finally, I have a washing machine so I don't have to do sink laundry anymore. So that's a positive. Basically, I'm just reading during the day while there's daylight. I haven't been closing the curtains here this is a provided accommodation I don't think it will be where I end up I think it's just for isolation purposes I'm not the only foreigner working for this company that's coming in so I think that's why there's sort of bits and pieces here from like previous people that have done this I haven't really unpacked at all using the same sort of clothing if I bother to get dressed at all <laughs> today I am going for my second COVID test and because now I'm out of the hotel isolation I need to be taken to a local hospital. I'm basically just continuing to be inside all the time in a very standard view with a tall apartment building. This is the washing machine. It's a one room. Really I'm still just using the one packing cube. As you know my food, the food that I have left which isn't much is in this one. There is another heat pump here but it is not great. I'm trying to upload another YouTube video and it is at 2%. Oh, it's gone up to 3%. You know that I use ExpressVPN here. I will definitely be back long before that's done. And then I just entryway, you can see that this is still packed. I was given a few items to start off with, which is nice. Um, and some, I really wanted some Frosties because I know you can get them here because I just miss crunching things but I do have a kitchen now with which I have never had an oven in China before so that is something yeah I'm actually doing dishes but it's fairly unpleasant in here really the only spot is this fairly uncomfortable couch otherwise I'm pretty much in bed what I didn't film was moving out of the hotel isolation here and then moving not across town a few kilometers to where I am now and you know because you're carrying all your stuff it's a hassle so certainly not filming that did pay when I was leaving the hotel isolation and then the next day which I didn't know like the first day I was like I'm gonna have a pajama day because nobody should be interrupting me of course I had to go for my first COVID test because I'd had a COVID test the day before I moved out of isolation and then you move and then the next day you've got to have another test. Nine. So actually today will be my 10th COVID test in under four weeks. So now I've had two days of uninterrupted living which finally feels gosh it's so nice and even though like for most of the time as you saw I was in my pajamas for the first temperature check and then oh that's my timer Ooh. let's see if these cookies are all right I've never used my timer on my phone before uh, okay well I didn't know you'd be joining me for this and I don't even know, I assume this is like, oh, where am I going to put it? I suppose I have to put it over here. Ooh, okay, a little bit browner. Okay. Oh my goodness, this looks like I'm so domesticated. Well, I hope they're delicious. For the most part, I've just been doing yoga in the morning when I get up to stretch, because that's always good. 
I suppose here if I was so inclined, but I'm not, there is more floor space to go for a walk. If I wanted to be like a polar bear in a zoo, walking around around in circles, but I don't. Um, also the floors here are very creaky, so I'm sort of conscious of the person below me. I don't know if they can hear me or not. I'm pretty sure in theory when I got out of the one week hotel here, I was like, yes, I'm halfway. Because I'm pretty sure it's six weeks in total, so I still have more than two weeks to go. Because now I need to be reliant on other people to bring me some food things. So this is also where I wish I'd planned better. I wish I'd bought more shakes with me. I still have some in my suitcase and I definitely had one this morning for breakfast. But yeah, I wish I'd bought more of those to really see me through. I'm just really missing hot food now. I've got the crunchy because I've got Frosties. I've eaten a lot of Frosties in a couple of days. Oh my goodness. I was hanging out for some crunch. I didn't realize it but yeah I, now I'm definitely missing like a hot meal. Yeah make sure that you bring a project of something that you want. Maybe it is. Maybe it's a really long book. Maybe it's a crime and punishment or a one of those classic long book. Maybe it's war and peace that you want to get through <laughs> this time after so many COVID tests and so much moving <sighs> I still have so far to go <laughs> so much more to go <gasps> alright please consider subscribing